How's it going guys and welcome back to Dub Gaming Entertainment. My name is Priest and today I'm continuing my Elder Scrolls 5 Skyrim mod review video with the Riverside Retreat Player House mod. Now <clears throat> I'm sure you all deeply know how much I'm into um, player home mods. They are my personal fave and I'll always like uh, doing player home mod videos. So, um, yes, Riverside Retreat is located, of course, right outside of Riverwood, right around here. Um, this is the location you will find it. And you normally enter it this side, so you can just walk right around here. It does not have a map marker, but it's right close to probably one of the main, um, settlement so you go up these stairs and you can come down the packed walkway to the riverside retreat now what we do in all the videos we do the exterior before we do the interior okay so outside we have the shrines all are able to be activated um we have our own um library looking thing out here we have a nice place to sit in and just enjoy the view outside of Riverwood. Now here we have some target practice. And some archery target practice. We can stand on here and shoot. Down here we have a built-in blacksmith forge with a workbench, grindstone, anvil, tanning rack. We have a smelter. Now here is a wood cutting station. Doesn't look like it comes with a wood cutting axe, that's the only complaint. And some beautifully uh, stacked wood. I like how they have it nice and stacked. Um, that's always a good thing. Now, hitting up the interior of Riverside Retreat. <clears throat> okay, so interior first here we have the enchanting laboratory with some so gems and some storage chests as you guys can see all empty and we have a display case and display new weapon we have the alchemy laboratory right next to it which is one of my complaints i don't like how they're um right close to each other i think they should have like different rooms for them but we have some alchemy um ingredients there with the lab we have some um black briar meat and black briar reserved um, some food on the shelf and some honey. Honey is a rare thing to have in this game. Right in the center, we have a nice little table to sit with your hot date, like Cicero. Um, we have a cooking pot and some arrows and a hunting bow. Right here, we have two chests, some gold with a map, and right over top of the map is a grizzly bear head. We have <clears throat> some end tables um, containing normal stuff in them. We have a Talos um, statue set on there. We have some display cases um, and a cupboard which holds natural resources that you'd find in any Skyrim player home. Another end table and a mannequin to display your epic armor piece. We have some fiber neatly ish stack next to the fireplace as well so a very nice player home i do enjoy this player home if you guys and if you guys also enjoyed this video leave a like comment and subscribe to the channel um this is my 97th skyrim mod review video i think so um many more to come in the future guys um Leave a like down below, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Support is always greatly appreciated here at Dub Gaming Entertainment, and I'll see you guys in the next video.